Hello everybody, Ginger Empire here, and we're going to discuss how to pan. Now when you set up everything, as you can see, the whole setup's over there. We just finished running it recently. You're going to be able to go in and out of your tent. Now within your tent, there's a few things. This is the coolest thing right here. You'll be able to eventually access a lot from here, which is awesome. And save your gold for a high gold day. As you can see, it peaks. If you want to sell out when it's in the 12s, and it was 1200 when I started, but it's, it's spiked down recently. Then it shows you all the land you can purchase, shows you the loans you can play, pay back. As you can see, I've almost paid it off. And you can also sell your gold from here. So you can get your gold and bring it back here. And then there's other features, but we'll go over those another time. But mainly, you want to come in here and you want to grab the gold pan off of the table. That is where your gold pan is. You don't have to buy one. And also when you start this ginormous basin will also be in there. But I moved it all outside because I like to work outside better. So we're going to come up here. We're going to dump some dirt in the pan. Pick your pan up with E. Place it in the water. You move up with right mouse click, down with left mouse click. So put it in the water. Shimmy it. Let the water go brown. Dump the water out side to side. Do it a couple times until you see all the gold. And what to look for with the gold is very, very obvious. Normally they're all the smaller pieces, but they'll look like dirt until you clean them up. So at this point we've cleaned off all the gold. You're going to tip it forward. Dump out the cocoa pebbles, as I like to call it. Dump out as much as you can without losing gold. It looks like we did lose a piece there, but that's okay. So this is good right here. So then you press shift and then you left click to sniffer it up. You sniff up every single one of the pieces of your gold. The big ones normally seem to weigh five to six tenths. The really small ones weigh a lot less. Sometimes it is n pretty impossible to sniffer. Move it around, try your hand. Make sure and use the riffles to your advantage as you can see here. You back it down off the riffles, and there's one staying on the riffle. Let's try that again. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't, but let's get that big one if we can. Right there. There we go. And as I said, sometimes they are tricky, but use the riffles. And there we go. We've got three pieces of gold, and they're all glitched out which is not good. This is the one part of the game that the devs know about and they are working on fixing. It's sometimes hard to sniffer the gold, but that is all that is involved with gold panning. So when you're done, you press E, drop your pan back down, and that is that. And now we are going to move on in our next video and we're going to talk about how to use a few of the other machines around the property. So you guys have a good time playing this game. This is the Ginger Empire. Make sure to subscribe and share with your friends.